humans. Yes, that's my thing. I have Tourette syndrome, which you hear a couple billion snorts on this uh, recording, like a billion snorts, a gajillion snorts, like snort city. But I'm on medicine that's slowing it down a lot. So, thumbs up to that because I hate the Tourette's and I hate the snorting. <coughs> I clear my throat like that too. But really, what this uh, this uh, video is about is my autism. And uh, I see so much negativity on autism all over the internet. To tell you the truth, I have nothing negative to say about it. <laughs> Seriously. <coughs> now, autism makes me talented in, like, so many ways. And, uh, yeah, I'll take my off, but not. <laughs> yeah, okay. The autism that I have, what well, that I have? I have uh, Asperger's Syndrome. And uh, I also have OCD, which I'm not really sure what obsessive compulsive do do or whatever it means, but uh, obsessive compulsive behavior is what they usually call it, but it's disorder or something. I'm not sure. I I think I know kind of have that. I know I have that, but yeah, not sure what it means. And um, anyways, the good stuff was about my autism because I actually got a lot and. Uh, Unfortunately, I don't have uh, my music that I made on a uh, CD or anything that's around here close. I forgot to even pick one up to around my place. <clears throat> but if you want to hear my music, this channel has uh, some music on it that I made. There's one called Andrea. <clears throat> and Andrea is, well, really my most ultimate favorite thing in the whole world. I think she's part of autism or something. Not her, but like me liking her. This is Andrea. This uh, binder I had since I was 14 years old. I'm 35 right now, which is the date you can see, 2019. This character it means everything to me, and she was not really put on the show very much, and they, they hardly showed her at all, and then they got rid of her pretty much. She's on TV show Reboot was anyways in 1995 to 98. And she means everything to me. And this, this binder, I don't let it go. Like, I love this thing too much. I, I hug it and you don't see me hugging it because that's the way my autism is. That, I guess that could be a negative to autism because I kind of love this character way too much. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, wait, there is my Tourette syndrome, of course. Because uh, that loud snort is not my choice. <laughs> Anyways, I, uh, to tell you the truth, because of this character, I started skateboarding when I was 14 years old. <clears throat> I, uh, really ride, uh, short longboards now, but I used to put soft wheels on skateboard and stuff, and that's another truck thing, I think. <clears throat> I used to put soft wheels on skateboard all the time, and softest wheels I could find, there was no longboard wheels in this town at that time. I could barely even get a skateboard, it, it, like, I had to go to another town to buy a skateboard. <clears throat> and uh, stuff like that, it was like really hard to get skateboarding anything around here that I didn't cost an arm and leg and I, I've always been on welfare. Even now I'm on welfare, so let's put that there. <laughs> this teddy bear I had since I was like, I don't know, 9, 10 years old and you can see that's old because it's really old. My brother got me that and it's a really precious bear. This one is my koala and yes, you know, you know, if you know anything about autism, we kind of change subjects really fast. <laughs> so, <clears throat> anyways, to the video, if I ever get to it, right? <laughs> um, I'm a photographer. This camera, <clears throat> which is uh, a thing called a DSLR or something like that. Um, I actually got it on uh, a website called Varaw Sale that you might never have heard of because it's kind of in this area. But uh, this camera, I bought, I got this, another lens, like a couple accessories, and then uh, this big, huge, beautiful bag. And the retail price is almost two thousand dollars at the time that this was new. I bought it for two hundred bucks for all of that. Uh, score. <laughs> Yeah, <clears throat> and uh, I love listening to music because I got my headphones here. I'm very attached to music. I used to make music all the time and then I kind of stopped for a while, but 
maybe sometime we'll go back to it, but I'm not really sure what to do with that music because it's kind of unique to music that people usually make. People usually make some kind of music in that one. It's more like Solitudes and stuff like that. It's piano sort of soft and I'm pretty sure it could sell, but I don't know how to do that. <coughs> Anyways, I'm a photographer and before I got that camera, I got the camera like a week ago or something, a couple a week or two ago. Before that, I'm a photographer. <laughs> was a photographer. Yeah, phono photographer with a phone, and I'm recording you on the, uh, recording me on the video with the phone right now. So, um, oh, it shocked me. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. This right here is a picture I took with my phone. I don't know how good you can see it, but this is uh, Steep Rock, Manitoba. This is dead center of the continent of Canada. And then this is uh, a lake. I don't know if it's called Winnipeg Lake or Winnipeg Lake or something or what lake it is, but it's, uh, when you go there, it looks like this color. And uh, there's some guy on a boat. And <coughs> this, uh, this actually has a story too. That was like the last photo I took that day. There was a storm coming in, like as you can see here. And uh, I just uh, went, uh, I, I asked my friend if I could just take one last picture before we went because we were leaving because of the storm. And uh, so uh, she said, okay, just one last picture. So I ran out there, ran onto the rocks thing, took the picture and ran back into the car. And I found out that this was <laughs> the picture I took that I ran to grab. A picture of. I just had to have one more picture and like this is the one of the most amazing pictures I have of that steep rock beach I love this picture I just love it and uh, I look at pictures like I'm I see pictures in my mind like I, I my mind works almost like a camera nowadays because you know how when you pick up a camera and like you can, if you have wide angle lens, you can like look at it from a weird perspective and stuff. Well, <clears throat> I can see that in my head. I can look at something and I know that it's a good picture. I was snapping almost all the time it's a good shot, but lots of times it isn't. Or sometimes it isn't or whatever, but like, <clears throat> there's a lot of shots I've done that really suck. To me anyways. Other people think it's good, but I think it sucks. This is some super zoom lens. This is uh, something I never had before. This kind of camera, I'm learning it. I never had one before. I never got to use one before of these kind because these are usually expensive as heck and it's like, wow. <coughs> um, I, I also you, painted for a long time. I don't paint anymore, but uh, well, I do sometimes, but not very often. This is a painting of, actually, it, it actually got ripped. Which is too bad, I know it's a good painting, but I'll have to find some way to fix that better than that, but I'll have to repair that and repaint that, fix it up, but this is uh, just a painting I did. Uh, I took a photo like this a long time ago, like 2008-2009, and uh, this is uh, just a field that used to be there. They don't have fields, there's buildings all the way there now. There was a field in that my old neighbor had uh, a little. So, I might as well show you my, uh, my paintings because this is the video for good things. I'm going to just take a peek if it's still recording. Uh, yeah, it's still recording. Okay. Okay. This painting has a story to it. I, uh, when I painted it, I wanted to paint over it. I hated it. <laughs> Don't ask me why because I love it now. But I used to, when I first painted it, I hate it. I wanted to get rid of it. I wanted to destroy it. And I know it doesn't make any sense to me now. That one to destroy, but I like it now. But it, it just looked awful before to me. But before uh, I was dumb. <laughs> this one has always been my favorite one. I'm gonna show you just now. This is imagination. Uh, that's what I think the ocean would look like if if I was there. And uh, these are some kind of birds that I see on the videos and stuff on the ocean stuff. Some rocks, some grass, or whatever it is. I don't know, I just made it up. <coughs> but I'm guessing the ocean will look kind of like my steep rock picture, but I'm not sure. Um, let's see here. This, uh, there was a picture in a calendar. I don't have the original picture in the calendar, but there was a picture in the calendar. 
and uh, it was of this tree and the sun, sunrise sunset, and uh, this is it. This, this isn't the picture in the calendar, but this is my painting I did. I should put more tree burn, more uh, little sticks and stuff like it. It looks a little bit better compared to the original picture, but. <laughs> Um, I know this is going to be a long video, so if you guys don't have patience, you might not want to watch it. This is, um, winter time. There was, uh, years ago I took a picture uh, outside, just like, uh, these, these were trees that were cut down after that, but it was just, this wasn't anyone's yard, it was just really in the middle of nowhere, and I stopped and I took a picture and then I left, and I painted it, and, uh, this is my painting of it just like in middle of nowhere, it was just, well it wasn't in the middle of nowhere, there was beach, but it was just kind of a photo that I painted. Um, this one, I don't, I really don't like this bird, I should not, I should not have painted it, but these birds are okay, and these were not, these birds were not in the shot before. The, the, the colors that you see here was in the original photo, but I did not have like the birds in the real photo or anything. So, uh, <coughs> sorry for the snorting, it's extremely annoying. A lot of my, four, my paintings I got rid of because I didn't like them, or my dad has them. Uh, some of them my dad has that I like. This one I don't totally love very much. I know you probably like, what? This one I love because it's a 